Good evening. Thousands of pro-independence campaigners have marched through Edinburgh and attended a rally. Police estimate that more than 8,000 went on the march. Meanwhile, the Better Together campaign said they were out speaking to undecided voters. John McCauley reports. Marching for a yes vote, the campaigners took their independence message through the streets of Edinburgh. The march ended with a rally on Colton Hill, where organisers denied they were preaching to the converted. All our time normally is spent talking to people who've still got to make up their minds. And I think events like today's can show people the strength of feeling, the strength of the commitment from people who've already decided to vote yes. But as people engage with the issues and think about the kind of country, the kind of society they want in Scotland, that's what moves people towards yes. Thank you. In another part of the capital, people campaigning against independence were using leaflets to spread their message. And they said the yes campaign should be doing more to answer questions. What I'm getting from an awful lot of people is they want to know much more about what's actually involved. They want to hear from those who are proposing change. And I think the biggest onus um, to give facts and details come from those who actually want such a major constitutional change. Organisers say people have come from all over Scotland from a range of backgrounds to take part in the march. It's the second of three pro-independence rallies which are planned and it comes just days after politicians and campaigners marked one year to go until the referendum. Joanne McCauley, Reporting Scotland, Edinburgh.